Northern pastors under the auspices of Arewa Pastors Forum for Peace have chastised governorship championing zoning of the presidency to the region. The forum says such a quest does not permit the general public to elect those they want to lead them in all elective position in the country. The national president of the forum, Bishop Jafet Mayo, articulated the forum's position in an interview with journalists at the Amadu Ribadu Square in Yola. Most of the betrayal that we have gotten, Christians has gotten in the north, are from Christians, fellow Christ, uh, political uh, Christians leaders. And the only thing they need is, is their self-interest. And when you ask them, I've interacted with a lot of them, they tell you clearly that self-interest, that they have their personal interest. So they use the church to gain, but we are going to believe that that narrative is going to change because we are going to work with our pastors and with our churches and we'll bring out truthful and rightful Christians. Because I remember that in the last 2015 elections, when the current government was going to come on board, the people they meet were the ministers forum in the north. They didn't meet Khan. But immediately the thing finished, there was an exchange. And the reason is I hope they couldn't go and get the real people that will stand for them, but they decided to cope in their friends. But it doesn't matter. But what we want to do is we want to say that 2023 must be a defining moment for any Christian politician, a true Christian politician in the North. A clergyman from the United States, Bishop Daniel Garza, says the church needs to be united for the body of Christ in Nigeria to reach its desired place. Be more, more in unity, have more, more freedom. It's, uh, right now, the Lord keeps putting it in my heart. We're so divided, and a house divided will never stand. And God gave me a scripture for today, Hebrews 12, 14, that without peace and holiness, we will not see the Lord. So peace is Jesus, holiness is a relationship. If we put it together, we'll have the, pre the, the peace and the love that we need. So people need to open their mind and understand. There's a big, showed me today, last night, in a big dream, there's a big spirit, of, a big serpent is loose. It's been unleashed. And that serpent is a, a deception, it's lies. People have been lied. It's time to come to the truth and the truth of Jesus. And Jesus will set us free. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.